You're watching College Football Live, presented by Dick's Sporting Goods. We've ranked the teams and filed reports on them on College Football Live. The countdown now reaches number three and what lies ahead for Oklahoma. The biggest question for the Oklahoma Sooners has to be up front on the offensive line where they lose four starters. Quarterback Sam Bradford won the Heisman Trophy last year. One of the biggest reasons why is because he was only sacked 13 times. That was third best in the Football Bowl subdivision. Huge task ahead for this offensive line to keep Sam Bradford on his feet so we can find some of those big weapons on offense to help score points as Oklahoma will try to play in its second consecutive national title. Off the radar. I think the emerging star for the Oklahoma Sooners is wide receiver Ryan Broyles. You look at this unit a year ago, Broyles had 46 catches and he was really the third or fourth best wideout. Now he was in the doghouse for a little bit and I think the year of experience and maturity will be very important for him. Remember, this unit lost at wide receiver Joaquin Iglesias and also Manuel Johnson. So nobody's feeling badly for Sam Bradford, but he does need receivers to step up. I think Boyles with his quickness and vertical ability will become that number one wide receiver that Bradford's looking for. Turning point game. The turning point game for the Oklahoma Sooners, October 17th, of course against the Texas Longhorns. Yes, Texas defeated Oklahoma last year 45 to 35, but this is another showcase game for the Oklahoma Sooners and their magnificent defense led by defensive coordinator Brett Venables and the returning Heisman Trophy winner Sam Bradford. If Oklahoma wants to get back to the BCS championship game, they have to defeat the Texas Longhorns. Prediction. I love this Oklahoma Sooners football team. Sure, they have some holes. I mean, they lost four starting offensive linemen, their top two wide receivers, but they still returned Sam Bradford, who won the Heisman a year ago. Outstanding running backs led by DeMarco Murray, Jermaine Gresham, the best tight end in the country, Ryan Broyles, an outstanding receiver. So there's plenty of talent. The defense will probably be the top defense in the country. Thing is, they're really going to get pushed this year with their schedule. This is a tough grind for Oklahoma. That's why I have them sitting at number three in my preseason poll. So the Sooners number three, and they're going to open in prime time on ESPN, 7 o'clock Eastern time against BYU. And then things get a little bit lighter before they go to Miami. And then the game that Mark mentioned against Texas, this is how they'll close out with Bedlam. Uh, what do you expect from the Sooners through this schedule? Pretty good? Yeah, I think they'll do well. I expect them to go 11-1. and one. I think Texas takes them out. Okay, so they're 11-1, and one, but still... Offensive line aside, you see any other glaring weakness on this team? Well, special teams is an inexplicable weakness. Certainly it was last year because the physical talent is there, but they've made mental errors that have given up so many big plays on special teams. Four kickoffs returned for touchdowns. That is very difficult for Coach Stoops to deal with because these are players that have the talent to do better. This kickoff return by Jordan Shipley for a touchdown turned the Texas game around. And it happened because two players made a mental mistake and got out of their lane. This is not a question of whether or not they can do it. It's a question of actually bearing down and focusing. Now, I don't want to make excuses for them, but the Sooners did kick off more than anybody else. Well, you'd think they'd have a lot of times. practice. Well, that's fair enough. Maybe it's something in the water in the state of Oklahoma. Oklahoma and Tulsa allowing four and three kickoffs returned for touchdowns. And uh, the other programs in the country who kicked off at least 100 times didn't happen as often. Can BYU run a kickoff back? We'll make you the smartest guy in the room coming up.